How's it going everyone? It's Gavin and Balls to you. I'm just going to do a quick video on prepping and sexing your baby bull pythons. Uh, it's a bit of a request so just imagine now we've cut the eggs, we've put the eggs back in the incubator and they've all come out the eggs or pretty much have all absorbed the, the yolk. Uh, this is a setting up stage. Okay, uh, Most people know what to do with it, obviously for those who are more experienced but for those people who are getting into it or just having your first clutches, these are questions that I get asked uh, and I feel the best way to do it is basically do a video. Um, I always sex my ball pythons as I'm cleaning them um, and then I resex them when they've all shed out. So I'll just quickly jump into it. First thing we're going to do, we're going to get some lukewarm water going in the sink, not too deep, not too hot. So that'll do, okay. And all we're going to do, we're just going to take our babies. This is a clutch I haven't shown on uh, YouTube yet, but I will. I have done videos, but I will go through them. <coughs> uh, I will do a video. Uh, I want to do a bit more uh, of a uh, out the egg and show show these guys off a bit more. So the first thing we're going to do is we're just going to wash them all up. So we just let them have a little chill and a swim for a little bit. You didn't pause that. I didn't. You can cut it. Yeah. Okay, so we'll let them have a, a swim and a chill. Okay, try not to stress them out. This one, as you can see, it, there's nothing left in the egg. It's just decided it, you know, basically can't be bothered to come out the egg. So we're going to basically take it out of the egg. It's absorbed all its yolk. Uh, he or she's just a bit like, just a bit tired and can't be bothered to come out. So we're going to take it out of the egg. <clears throat> As you can see, it's pretty much absorbed all its yolk. There's a little bit left, so we're just going to help it and just uh, give it a little bit of a a wash. While that's in there, I'm going to prep the egg box or the the box that they're going to go into to shed out. Basically, we've just got a tub here, like so. And all I'm going to do is take some kitchen roll, which I'll show you in a minute. <clears throat> I'm going to take our kitchen roll. What you're going to do is basically put it in the base, like so. Get some lukewarm water and just put that in there. So that they can shed out. Now the idea is, guys, to keep this paper towel moist all the time because we like to keep the uh, the uh, humidity high in there. Okay, so that's where the snakes are going to go after we've bathed them and sort of sexed them and put them all in there. Okay. Right. First things first. Obviously, they've got loads of vermiculite or you know yolk or gunk stuck all over them. So we're going to give them a good sort of wash over the face like so okay so that's a little normal so all we're gonna do is the camera see if we can get it in the right area all you're gonna do is basically sort of hold it at the base of the tail this doesn't hurt them, and all you're going to do, just roll up, and that's a female. No hemipenes there, it's nice and white, that's a female normal, okay. It is early in the morning guys, uh, so we're just, uh, while we're doing this, do this little pastel next. Same principle, try and do this a bit better. So what you're going to do is you're going to sort of get it at the base 
finger behind the, the vent. You're going to pull back a little bit. This is very, very small amounts of pressure, guys. All you're going to do, this thumb here is going to roll up. Okay, and that's all you're going to do. Roll it up. As you can see. Hang on, guys. Yeah, you're going to the sunshine. There's a hemipene. I'll get it again. Small amount of pressure, there's the both of them. Two hemipenes. Okay, so that's male. You will have uh, either <coughs> side of the vents, you will have um, scent glands, which are tiny little horn like things that stick out. So when you pop them, um, you'll actually see that, that it does look a bit like a. Uh, little horns they're not hemipenes they are sink uh, glands okay guys so let's do the uh, Cosmo Harvey just getting off all the vermiculite for the head and Again, I'm going to try and do this. Pull back a little bit of a wee, a oh, bit of poo. Let's try again. Very small amounts of pressure, guys. Let me just get it right. Okay. And there is his two hemipenes popping out. Okay. I know it's a bit difficult to see, but trust me. <coughs> Most cost my Harvey. Okay. Do this pastel or whatever it is. This is a, a very interesting clutch and I am doing a video on these so I'm not gonna spend too much time on them, but this is just more so how to clean them and prep them and get them ready for them to go in the box into your rack ready for them to shed out just get all the slime off Okay guys, right, this one's going to be a little bit better. Um, with the males, they're a bit more redder than white. Okay, so just, uh, just let it calm down. Oh, calm down. Let me just stop wriggling about. Right, okay guys. I haven't actually got to just let it focus in. Okay, I haven't got to actually apply much pressure and this guy's hemipenes are coming out. There, okay, I'm just releasing, it just goes back in. Very small amounts of pressure guys. You don't need to be uh, heavy handed at all, especially at this stage. I find sexing the baby ones are a lot easier than sexing the adults. I will do and show, do a video on sexing the adults. Uh, but that's a probing kit that I tend to use rather than using this method. Okay. Let's clean this, uh, this little one up. It's a stunning past RV. That's what we're shooting for. <clears throat> so it's 
this one will cooperate a bit better. Mm -hmm. Okay, just come further over this way. Okay, you know you can't see it, but basically there's nothing coming out there and it's pretty white. Okay, bit of poo. Okay, nothing there whatsoever. <laughs> Keep pooing on me. You got, you got to not mind poo in this uh, mm. in this uh, hobby, guys. Can't have afford to have a weak stomach. <clears throat> okay, try again. No, I'm just gonna do it again. Okay, basically, I don't know if you can see, but it's nothing but pure white, and there's nothing coming out there at all. Very gentle. That's the uh, Cosmos Starby. Beautiful. Like I said, guys, I'm going to do a better video with these. Um, I want to wait for them to shed out first. I have got the egg cutting video for this one as well. I'm going to do it all together because it's uh, a bit of a long-winded video. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed the video, if there's any questions, um, please don't hesitate to ask, um, if you need to know anything, uh, just, just by all means put the comment in the comment boxes below, um, and uh, thanks for watching, hope you're enjoying the videos, okay everyone, take care.